Alright guys, and we are back to more Persona 4 Golden, and before we even talk to Dojima, let's look at the schedule. So on the 8th, we will go eat at Aya, maybe. Mm. Let's not hang with Dojima yet. Let's see if we can do anything to increase our courage up here, because this sucks. Cause that's one of the most things I need to boost up right now so we can hang out with that other social link I got persistence I'm an expert persuasive I'm just I'm still average I need to boost up my courage screw this there's got to be a way to boost up my courage at night yes Dojima lets me out at night because I have a part-time job I can go to I need to be reliable. That sucks. Shit, what the fuck can I do to boost my damn uh, courage? I need something to boost my courage, man. This sucks. Alright, so let's go back home. I have no clue what I can do to boost courage at this point. I can't even go to the karaoke bar. Dun, dun, dun. <sighs> Man. Is there any books I can read, maybe? There's gotta be like a scary book I can read or something. The Bully Teacher Volume 1. Uh, let's work, because we need money anyway. You decided to work on making envelopes. You quietly continued the dull task. Work? Yeah, let's do that. An attempt to make them absolutely perfect. You came over... Overly meticulous, and your pace slowed down so much that you were unable to reach your goal. Ah, oh, that was so bad. I guess I should only try to <clears throat> speed up the pace. Oh, I should never do that again. Noodles really hit the spot. Yum yum, and your tum tum. You know, the rainy season's just about here. Isn't it a little early? Once it starts, it'll be raining every night. We'll have to keep a constant eye on the midnight. Jeez, every night? That sounds like a lot of work. Crap, I didn't even think of that. Well, so it goes. <laughs> I thought you were worried about the rain because of the school camp out. <laughs> Why are you so excited about that? That's right, it's the first time for you two. You realize the only purpose of the school campout is to develop a love for one's hometown and young people, right? What? <laughs> yeah, they tell us that up front, so? Well, you see, the way we supposedly develop that love is by picking up trash off the mountain. That's bad. Uh, I don't want to do that. That's boring. Picking up trash? Develop a love my ass. That's slave labor. <laughs> well, the night's kind of fun. We cook our own meals with mess kits and sleep in tents. Sleeping in tents. The four of us are in the same group. Hmm. Huh. The same group, huh? Does that mean we sleep together at night too? You wish. <laughs> Guys and girls sleep in different tents. I'm gonna sneak into a girl's tent at night I'm and see what you. happens. If you leave your tent at night, you'll be expelled on the spot. <laughs> on the spot, damn. Is it worse? gets worse and worse. I thought it was gonna be fun. It's only for one night, and we disband before noon the next day. It doesn't last very long. That's so lame. Oh, we did have some fun at the river before going home last year. Do they let you go swimming? I think so. There's always someone who takes a dip, although we didn't. I see. So you can swim in the river. Hmm. 
What kind of mischievousness is Yosuke up to? Oh, look, it's Maruka. Hey, Tetsuya, do you know this week is health week? And you're not a part of the Student Health Association, in other words, you're a lazy bum. Man, I got two clubs. I got cultural club and the sports club. I hate lazy good for nothing kids like you. So I'm signing you up to take the place of a sick man. What the hell is wrong oh, with you? Wait. I don't know what school's like for you big city kids, but here it's every student's duty to pitch in. Don't tell me you're not enough of a man to do something this easy. <laughs> Fine, I'll do it. Then go straight to the infirmary. Fuck you, Maruka. Fuck you. I'm more of a man than you'll ever be, Maruka. Oh, hi, hero. Was it the transfer student rank? Did you get hurt or something? You told him about you've been sent to here. You told him that you've been sent here to replace a sick member. Thank goodness we're running low on people. We need to check around the school to see if anyone needs help, but someone has to stay and watch this room. Would you mind staying here and dealing with anyone that stops by? No problem. No touching the medicine, of course. If someone who hurts shows up, use the first aid kit. They're pretty uncommon, though. Okay. Someone's here. Oh, no. Hello, I'm Kaito from Santo Pharmaceuticals. Hmm, aren't there any adults here? Could you deliver a message for me then? Your school plays an order for dolls? I need to know if the order can wait until the next month after. Give my regards to your teacher. He said the next month after, so that's two months. Thanks for your help. Anything happen? You told her that a representative from the pharmaceutical company came. Oh, we should have since they called him back. Do you remember his name? Um... Both of these are the same. Kital from Santo. From Sa I don't remember where the fuck he's from, to be honest. I don't remember where he was from. Fuck. I think it was from Santo. Yeah, I do remember myself saying Santo. Oh, about the gods, huh? What did he say? He said the next month after, so he it said, can it come in two months? Right? Yeah, I think he said that. Got it, I'll call Sensei. You had to relay the message to the teacher. I contacted them immediately, thank you. You gave them the correct information. Your knowledge has increased, your expression has increased. All right, let's discuss what we found while we went around the school. Okay, group one. Oh, that's right, you went alone. Yeah, since Konishi isn't here, oh damn. He can't help it after what happened. Yeah, poor thing, so you just have to do his this part too. Hey guys. I'm sorry I'm late. Who is this cool looking student? You don't have to come really. Helping out at your parents' store is hard work, right? We have a replacement, so don't worry. Cool looking kid. I don't want to be the only one. You can help Hero Khan clean up the room then. We'll go report to the teacher, so why don't you clean a little and go home? This dude looks su suicidal. <laughs> Male student. I'm Konishi, a first year. So was he related to Saki Senpai? Ah, right. They're friends with ha Hanamura, right? I hate him, and you too. Can I go home now? Sure, why not? Goodbye. You did your part and helped the Student Health Association as ordered. The other members didn't return, so you decided to go home. I wasted my whole fucking day with that, man. Welcome home. Hey, Nanako. Yes, Nanako looks as if she not she's not doing anything. Nanako is going to become closer soon. Yeah, why not? Spend time with yeah. Nanako. You decided to watch TV with Nanako. It's a documentary about a young man searching for his real father. Nanako is staring into the TV. A real father. Hey, big bro. What do they mean by real? <laughs> Always by your side, a person you love a lot. Let's say related to you by blood, since it's the truth. Blood related? I don't get it. Nanako seems confused. Maybe. 
Maybe I'm not real to him. Daddy doesn't come home because I'm not his real daughter. It's not true. That's not true. But Dad's not here. Nanako doesn't seem to be satisfied with that answer. Mommy. Why she leave me? When Mom was still here, we all went out together. We picked flowers at Samagawa. Okay, that was weird. Is that not his? Is that not her dad? Is Dojima not her dad? Her blood related dad? Hey, big bro. It's about Nanako's bedtime. What should you do? Let's listen to her talk. You don't have enough understanding. Fuck you. <laughs> Fuck you, game. Don't tell me I don't have enough understanding. Let's put her to bed. That's just what dad would say. Nanako looks sad. The game wouldn't let me say what I wanted to say. It ain't my fault, Nanako. Don't get mad at me. <laughs> don't get mad at me. It's not my fault. It's the game's fault. Get mad at Persona 4 Goten. <laughs> it's June already? Well, good news. Tatsumi Kun from the first year is back with us, so trying to get some good example. Now, I know it's the rainy season, and you may not be very motivated, but let's keep our spirits up together. I always hated this weather since I can't go out and exercise, but watching sports on TV isn't bad either. I saw the hike and die competition the other day. Now, I can see why men would be afraid to try it. Hey, hero, what is the heck a die? Huh? How am I supposed to know this? The heck and die. Oh, time to go random. I don't know the fucking thing. You gave her the answer you think is correct. Wow, I'm amazed. <laughs> Dude, I love doing the random. I don't ever seem to get wrong by doing that. Balance beam is hike and die in Japanese. I bet you kids hear the same the word beam you think about lasers or something, but it refers to them. Timber, beam, blah, 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 blah. You're a smart guy, hero. I'm not smart. I just kind of bullshitted through that whole thing. I bullshitted through my quiz, my freaking uh, exams, too, which is hilarious. Huh, now what? Hey, guess what I just heard? What? When they're sitting in back of you, it's like a squeeze play. What? What are you talking about? Come on, you know what I mean? No, I don't. The hell are you talking about? Sorry, I got it ahead of myself. What I mean is... I'm talking about how when there's a girl sitting behind you on a motorcycle, they press right up against your back! <laughs> what does? <laughs> Let's be oblivious. What does? Look, don't make me spell it out. <laughs> anyway. I think motorcycles are the hot new thing for guys now. Girls like guys who spend time outdoors, right? So I got you this. Want to get your license with me, partner? Uh, it's a manual for getting a motorcycle license. Sounds like a lot well, of work, man. I can't man. afford anything bigger than a scooter on my budget. But at least that'll let us get to new places. Don't you think we deserve that much, seeing as how we're investigating the case? I can understand. So yeah. Let's get old. Let's go get our license. What's up, senpai? Hey, about the camping trip. You guys busy right now? Kinda. We're talking about motorcycles. Motorcycles? You gonna go stomp a gang? <laughs> if you're bringing a war, I'll help. <laughs> no, we're not bringing a war. What does that mean, anyway? <laughs> we're just talking about getting motorcycle licenses. Licenses? You guys don't have yours? What, Kanji has one? Huh? No way! Don't tell me you already... Nah, I'm still 15 and all. <laughs> then why'd you say it like that? Damn, Kanji sounds pretty damn, uh, manly to be 15. Man, that reminds me. I'm surprised you picked a fight with that biker gang. How'd you chase after them? Eh, the bike's all I need for that. In any case, we can't let you in on our up-close-and-personal plan. <laughs> Up close and personal? What does that mean? Keep it down. Like I was telling this guy, what a guy needs nowadays to be a big man is first a motorcycle, and then... And then... <laughs> a girlfriend. 
You're like a kindergartner. So you're over her? Tell me more. Tell me more about this, Yosuke. Now that's my partner. All right then. You guys gonna get licensed for the big stuff? I mean, I know I came in late here, but if you're talking about taking a girl on a bike, you gotta be seen too, man. That ain't allowed on a scooter. <laughs> I forgot about that. Shut up, this'll work out. As long as we have a motorcycle, the girls will come running. That's all the advantage we'll need. <laughs> Bros game, now, man. Listen carefully. The reason we don't have girlfriends is because we're stuck here in this town waiting to meet someone. This place is so tiny, it's no wonder we can't find one. It doesn't matter if it's only a scooter. Some kind of motorcycle is just the ticket for us to get some chicks. Then, later on, we can get a bigger motorcycle. And that's when the up close and personal plan really starts. <laughs> Broske, really. Up close and personal. Plus, you know, you and me have more of a city boy thing going on. If we're serious about this, we've got to expand our horizons to a bigger town. We gotta to take the initiative. There's no time to wait for a train that only leaves every so often each day. <laughs> we'll roar up on our motorcycles like the badasses we are, and when the chicks come up, we'll play it cool. The pheromones dripping off of us will bring them around in no time. <laughs> <laughs> the dialogue is so awesome. Oh my god. Fe feral zone? No, we're not going to a cat house, you idiot. I'm talking about pheromones. My research shows that a motorcycle is the number one surefire way to increase a man's pheromones. Pheromones. <laughs> pheromones. Dude, that's how a perv would react. <laughs> what did you say? Fine, then I'm in too. Get ready for Kanji Tatsumi to show his manhood to these chicks. I already told you, you can't. Anyway, don't tell anyone about this, got it? If other guys try to copy us, it'll end up diluting our pheromones. <laughs> <laughs> so, partner, make sure you talk to your uncle about getting a license, okay? Got it. Not you. I don't even know your uncle. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. I'm serious about this. If we have motorcycles, we can go all over. It'll be fun! It's true that with a motorcycle, your range of activity activities will increase somewhat. Man, somewhere out there, the best days of our youth are ahead of us. <laughs> yeah, I'm with you on that one. <laughs> hey, Kanji, <laughs> he just forced himself into the conversation. I love that. Will someone appear on the midnight channel when it rains again? You have no choice but to wait. All right, so let's go ahead and save it real quick. So, should we go get our license? How did we go about doing that? Hey, it's, this girl wants another quest? Did you hear? It seems there's a ghost at Tashumi Shrine. If you go there at night, a woman's ghost will approach. And she threatens you unless you give her fish. Why fish, though? That's not something people carry around with them, you know. I don't know. I don't think I can go near the shrine for a while. Listen. You got it. Pretty common. Something like a crooked cross would be nice. So I need to get a crooked cross for this woman. I don't know where to get it. We probably got to go into the TV world and get it. So, okay. Let's look around the building a little bit. There might be some new quests going on. Since she's gave me a new quest, let's look around for some new quests. Alright. Alright. Let's see. Let's look around the room. The men's bathroom. Let's use the bathroom. You use the time to replay. Remember that you're growing something in the garden. You should tend to it sometime. Nothing that way. Oh. Uh, oh man. I didn't know what was going on there. The camera completely changed perspectives for a second. So, you know, let's go to the practice building real quick. See if there's anybody there. It's Kanji, yo. Senpai! Let's go into the TV. Kanji seems anxious to visit the TV world. Not today. 
Oh, you're busy, huh? Maybe next Later, time, then. senpai. Later, bro. Who's this girl looking in the wall? Not many people come here, so I find it a relaxing place to hang out at. Blah, 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 blah. Let's go upstairs. Oh, uh oh. -huh. Who is this kid? So fan. I'm not trading you my silk fan, fool. You ain't getting my silk fan for nothing. Hey, look, a new quest. No, wait. This is the same quest. I don't know. Damn it, I knocked it out of fucking view. Alright. So let's get the hell out of here. Let's go. Let's go into town. <clears throat> I don't even have enough money to eat at Aya. Did I go back to the school? I feel stupid. Go in the town. <laughs> I need to. <a> st <laughs> oh my god. Let's see if we can sell anything to. Uh, so we can eat at Aya. You know, let's stop by. First of all, let's talk to Margaret. That's one of the things I want to do. Damn, Igor and Marie's gone. They actually leave? Oh. Hey, Margaret. Excuse me. Do you have any business here? Hmm. As you can see, my master is currently away. Where'd he go? If your errand isn't urgent, I regret to ask that you come back late. No, that won't do. This room is bound tightly to your fate. Nothing here happens without a reason. There must be meaning in our meeting here alone. What the hell? Welcome to the Velvet Room. I am Margaret. I know that already. I am the one who rules over power. Invited here after my predecessor's sudden disappearance. Predecessors? You may be the first person who has ever been welcomed here by someone other than my master. The Velvet Room is inseparable from the heart of its invited guest. The shape of the room and its residence are selected by my master, based on the number of guests and their destiny. Hmm. Shall we chat? I feel that is what I'm called to do. Sure. A faint smile appeared on Margaret's face. Her eyes have a hint of gentleness in them, unlike her normal gaze. You feel a faint bond forming with you and... <laughs> okay, that's not what I came in here for. I came in here to talk... Well, I did come in to talk to Margaret, but I did not expect to form a social link with her. What is she? Ah, she's the Empress. Okay, I actually came here to talk to her because my expert, you know, I, my knowledge became an expert or whatever. Maybe that's what it was for. It seems you already have several social links. Reoccurring mem uh, memories, Re recurring meetings, recurring words by deepening your understanding of one another, your bonds strengthen. But sometimes the heart is shaken more by a single action than a thousand words. Do you understand? Somewhat. Hmm. Today's meeting might be classified as that single action. I've decided. The strand of fate you follow entangle me within it as well. Perhaps a new bond will soon be spun. There's something I have wanted to know, and you are the first guest I welcomed here. In light of today's meeting with my master absent, hmm, I believe we are both special to one another. Margaret is smiling. That's weird. I want to know more about you. First, I think I should have you show me your rare persona ability. Let me see. Show me an Ipon Datara that knows Shukai. What the hell? The heart is shaken more by a single action than about a thousand. Have you forgotten already? I, wi I wish you well. Alright, so I basically had to fuse a certain persona with a certain ability. Which shouldn't be too hard thanks to the skill card system. And then I can duplicate all that stuff. So that's, that's going to be easy. But anyway, I was trying to eat at Aya, wasn't I? But I need money to eat at Aya. So we got to go to the workshop. 
Area of the Soul. Um, expendable. Let's sell some of those life stones we got. I don't ever use them. I'd be pretty mad if those life stones come in handy later on, and I just sold like a bunch of them. Chinese dining aya. Uh... Hopefully our courage will increase here. Hopefully we can get our courage to increase. The Mega Beef Bowl Challenge. Yes, average to reliable. So now we can actually go at to the shrine at night. All right, time to go home. After school, evening time. Hey, look at that, it's Hadachi. Ah, you're back. Hi there. Yo. You want some meal too? Fair warning, it's from the supermarket. <laughs> well, excuse me. It's delicious though. I can't believe it was on sale. What are these guys Sorry, doing? Sorry, this guy eats instant noodles every day. That constant slurping got on my nerves, so I called him. <laughs> you don't have to bluff like that. You just wanted to eat dinner with a coworker, right? Don't be stupid. But eel was a great choice. Nanako-chan loved it at least. I'd say she's eely proud of her daddy. <laughs> Boo. That was pretty Didn't lame. Did slip away? It is an eel after all. <laughs> it was funny, but it was lame. Just eat your dinner. Y yes, sir. Nanako-chan's such a good girl, though. She went straight to do her homework once her plate was clean. It's not every day you get to eat eel. You'd think she would have spent some more time savoring it. You think that because you slack off too much. You should follow her example. <laughs> <clears throat> Way to hit where it hurts. You need to consult Dojima about getting a motorcycle license. What's the matter? A motorcycle? You mean a scooter? Oh, that's right. Kids your age can ride those. Yep. Uh, I don't know, though. You, what do you mean you don't know? You better Come know. On, don't be a spoil sport. It's no surprise he wants one out here. I understand how you feel since I'm from the city myself. The trains don't run that often, and walking around everywhere is pretty inconvenient, isn't it? Right. Yeah, it's a hassle. Right? It's criminal. You say that, but... <laughs> that reminds me, I remember you telling me something once, Dojima-san, about some of the reckless things you did on your motorcycle when you were young. <laughs> Tell me about you it. You moron. Think before you talk. And once you're done eating, hurry and... <sighs> I wonder what Dojima was doing. He was in the biker gang himself, hey. I bet. <laughs> hmm. All right, we'll be there soon. Looks like I made the right choice to skip the booze. <laughs> That's the third time he said that in the game. Adachi, you were the one in charge of that file, right? File? Oh, did that suspicious guy show up again? Would you keep your mouth shut? We're going back. Get in the car. Back? You mean to the station? But I haven't had my eel liver soup yet. What about my license, bro? Can I get my license, bro? Can I get my license? Can I get my license? Can I get my license? That's all I need to know. Can I get my what license? What this license? Did you decide on this yourself? N no one talked you into it. Does it matter? I know it's hard without a way to get around, but two-wheeled vehicles can be dangerous. Do you understand? Yes, I understand. I'll be careful with it. I'm sure I can trust you to do that. But allowing you to get one is another thing. Dojima seems trouble. Come on, man. Come on. Come on. Just please give me my... Don't give me that face. <laughs> I know you're serious about this. First, you need a license. We can talk about this again when you have one. Well then, sorry to dump this on you, but I need you to look after the house. I look after the house every single day. That's no problem. From Yosuke. Yo, it's me. What up? How did it go with your uncle? I've been on the edge of my seat thinking about it. Seriously? 
Seriously? Then let's go get ours as soon as we can. Yeah. I gotta hit the books. Let's make sure we both pass together. Nice. You wonder about this suspicious guy Dachi mentioned, but there's no way to find out more about it for now. You should review the manual Yosuke gave and review the license. Okay. So it, it skipped our current day. That's weird. So that whole scene skipped that day. I couldn't even save it. That sucks. Yawn morning. Yosuke seems sleepy. I went to bed, but the details kept bugging me, so I never get up again to check the manual. It never ended. I ended up getting almost no sleep after all. At all. Well, if you're gonna do this, let's pass on the first try. How are you feeling? It'll be a breeze. Now that's my part, and I see you haven't forgotten about our up close and personal plan. <laughs> let's make sure we're not late to the exam. We'll leave as soon as school is out. Early morning, after school. Classes have ended for today. You promised Yosuke that you would go to your license, go get your license with him after school today. You should get going. Jeez, I can't even save it, man. You take the license and exam with Yosuke. The answers seem to be flowing from your hand. You succeeded in passing the exam. Obtain scooter license. Nice. on the first try just like we planned <laughs> actually it was pretty easy I might have studied a little too hard it's Dojima hi are you on duty we just stopped by to get gas and well to take care of some minor business where did you guys go <laughs> Let's say yes. <laughs> I'm starting to sound like Nanako. <laughs> if you're trying to test my detective skills, then... Let's see. Given that triumphant look on your face... Huh. I give up. Where? <laughs> really? I can tell what a suspect's thinking when he's lying. But when it comes to where you two might go... <laughs> Our motorcycle licenses! We went together and got them in one try! Already. Yep. I know it's just a written test to get a scooter license, but still, I wasn't expecting you to pass so soon. Oh well. Oh, believe in me more, Dojima. Damn. <laughs> Looks like I better think of a way to convince my sister. Huh? Dojima has a sister. Oh yeah, my mom. <laughs> I can't say no now that you've gotten your license. Your enthusiasm is catching. Yes, you got the okay. I need to head home and read through the catalog. Well, see you tomorrow. Peace out, Yosuke. Do you know if I borrow you a sec before you head back home? Yeah, no problem. Hey, Adachi. I just finished filling it up. Filling what up? Sorry for dragging you into this. This is my scooter. Whoa. I had it fixed at the shop. It may be old, but it runs pretty well. Oh, cool. So that's what he was I doing? I put gas in it, but I wasn't expecting to hand it over today, too. Oh, nice. I'm letting you have it. Yeah! The best uncle ever. This is a nice bike. You can tell? The local shops don't carry twist grips, so I had one of the repair guys at work help me out with it in secret. Uh, don't tell anyone that, okay? Ojima's passion for the scooter is obvious. <laughs> you're always so strict at the station, but you're a cool dad inside, huh? Shut up, Adachi. <laughs> you always yell at me. Of course, because you're an idiot, Still, Adachi. I wish we had a sleek means of transportation like that. Who knows when that suspicious guy will show up again? Hasn't he been using professional quality cameras to take pictures of people's houses from the Amagi Inn to around here? What the? What is he talking about? Looks like he knows the back streets, too. So a car won't be. Will you stop blabbering like that? 
Go back to the car. Get in the... Get, go get in the car. Go get in the car, Dachi. Well, anyway. I was around your age when I got my license, too. I took the test behind my parents' back. When my dad caught me riding a scooter later on, he gave me a good thrashing. <laughs> <laughs> he got thrashed. That's hilarious. Don't tell Nanako about that, okay? Dojima is chuckling mischievously. Since I've already given the okay, I won't bug you about traffic laws. Just be safe when you're riding it. For sure. You do that, and I'll look the other way if you decide to ride it out of town. Can you promise me? For sure, man. Good. I'll hold you to that. Nice. You received Dojima Scooter. As you ride around and get a feel for the local roads, you will be able to go to more places. Nice! So before we even ride out on the scooter... Oh wait, it's gonna pass the evening time. I need to save it. So what we'll do, we'll go in the town, we'll go use the save point in the shopping district. We'll save, and once we come back, we'll try the scooter. Do, 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 do. Hey, this girl has a quest. Someone got me and my Miss sister mixed up again. Listen to her. I don't want to walk home with my sister, but I don't know where she went off to. I'll look for her. So we gotta find her younger twin. So we'll do that next time. On P4G. Do, 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 do.